Hello, everyone. Raven's Librarian here with my playthrough of Steam World Quest. In the last part, we recruited Oreck after saving him twice from a cage. Well, two different cages. He somehow wound up in a second one in the same chapter. And after traveling through the cave, we rescued some of the villagers and heroes that had been captured by the Void Army. This is the fight I think it is. Yeah, I think I'm gonna need it. So I ended up remembering the fight that happens in this chapter. I remember having a lot of trouble in the fight when I first played it. So I looked up a guide that like any ideas as to how to avoid it.
Yeah, there's the dragon. Oh, a dragon. I've never seen a real dragon before. I have, but only safely contained on college ground. And this one wears the same kind of farting with identical symbols. The directives and the spirit of the alchemy college have clearly been breached. Is it alchemy or alchemy? No, it's alchemy. That's stubborn bunch from the village. Be warned, I've been provided with this dragon from my new alchemical friends, and I won't hold back this time. Tell us who your ally is, you twirling bird brain. Hm, <laughs> no regret that wording. Ah, we beat you once, we'll beat you again. Watch as I have no contribution to this fight. Yeah, the guy definitely said you want to take out this guy first. Bit annoying that I don't know what the odds are that they'll actually wait maybe
Oh, that was lucky. messes up him, it should mess up me. It's annoying, but there.
preparando The only problem here is I'm wearing the wrong mask. I don't have any cart witch. So I'm just gonna stuck with it. Only this guy, yeah. Thing I'm used to wheeling. After games, we've come to save. Time for supper? Wait, wait a minute, you're not the guards. We took care of those void goons, every last one of them. I see. And you are. Sorry about that, that's my dog. Gets a little grumpy at this time. Perhaps you remember me from my applications to the guild? Can't say I do. I also help restock the guild's winter supplies and my parents have a grocery stand right outside. Are you the daughter of George and Ezra Bigfinger? Uh, no. Are you Gertrude, that little chub with the limp leg? Oh. No, and no. Are you the daughter of anyone in the guild? Uh, like I said, my, my parents are grossy. Ah, you're part of the help. That's why I don't remember you. Why do you, why do they make these people so unlikable? Oh. Look, I appreciate whatever you think you did here. But the guild is reserved for a higher standard, as you can see by my poorly placed hat and my gold chain necklace here, which, which spells my name because apparently I'm so forgettable. A membership can only be awarded to those who meet the requirements. But, but we saved you! Now, now, for all we know, those Void Army fellows realize their mistake. Of locking up real heroes. Yes, the mere thought terrified them as they feared our next move. The move of staying put in the cage. Ah, a well tried tactic. <clears throat> Those buffoons blindsided us. 
As a matter of fact, we were already blindfolded in preparation for Lenny's big barbecue surprise. Surely, you must be curious about why this Void Army decided to round up guild heroes. It doesn't strike me as that important, and don't call me Shirley. Is that an airplane reference? Or oh, wait, no. Oh, it, it, it was the actor who showed it was. It's from a famous comedian. There's an act, a famous comedian actor who, who was famous for using that line a lot. Can't can call his name. All right, Gil. Let's return to the village. These those shrimp we left on the Barbie must have tanned nicely by now. Okay, and that I assume is a. Uh, the only person I know who says that is an Australian person, but that might just be a gross stereotype. Tan shrimps go perfectly with chocolate. Look, I hate them, but I. I, I do, in fact, want to have a chocolate fountain. I, I do not regret that at all. Pretty sure it would go terrible with shrimp, though. I just never tried it. I, I just, but I don't, I don't see how that could be appealing. Like salt and like, I mean, it, no, 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 Well, they're heading back, and so should we. Saving the guild heroes, check. Defeating the dragon, check. What more can I do to impress the guild? That blowhard gains is nothing but a limp peacock. This is more than just simple kidnapping. Possible involvement from the Alchemy College makes it a much bigger than we first thought. Because now it's something I know about. Which means it's important. At least that feels like where her mindset is coming from. I mean, I think this all just became a serious issue the minute they started kidnapping an entire town. What did we think? In fact, why is this our problem? We've done what we set out to do. Save the heroes. Village is safe. Let's go home. This is not only about the village. It goes way beyond that. Dark Lords and the Alchemists being involved. I have seen the results of abusing Alchemy before. Well, I think that's the first time we've seen him actually angry. If you good people don't mind, I would like to accompany you to this Alchemy College. Oh, hey, Armley's back in the mood. Alright, team. There are more baddies to beat than sign me up. I'll show the guild master. I'll make him change his mind. Well, Galil wasn't that hard to convince. After having vanquished the dragon, our curious quartet briskly follows the trail, pointing towards the noble college of Alchem. So, yeah, it's like I. Just like I remember, that's one of the few places I have a strong memory of. Well, not the- there's two- there's one other place I have a strong memory of that comes later. But, well yeah, so that was obviously a fairly short chapter, although, you know, I, I do appreciate- I'm not sure if, the, if it was necessary to split it up, but I do appreciate that they give you a pretty reliable place, like they give you a safe statue to restart right next to a shopkeeper. Like, that in itself is fairly common, but, I mean, it's very obvious that they want you to have the ability to respect your deck and your party. And, you know, they, didn't they don't force you to, if by some accident you lose your file, they don't force you to redo the entire chapter that came before now, which was that mountain passage. I don't know if that was the intention, or if they just, for some reason, felt that this one boss warranted its own chapter, like, there was some issue with the save system. Or the so the net the file, uh, but regardless, like I, I do appreciate having the ability to like respect because I, I I had the advantage of just I looked it up because I remembered having that that fight was a really hard one when I first did it, so, and even then like there were a few things I definitely could have done better like I should have probably gone with the mage and given her the chain command that triggers for the barrier. Because that was the one that was gonna, that was gonna, that would have helped me a lot with the AOE attacks that the end, the dragon and the uh, canary knight dude kept spanning. But no, outside of that, like the the fight definitely wasn't too unreasonable. Like it, it, despite you know, like it does feel like that boss fight is like one of the next big curves. Like the last, the previous fight was pretty hard, but I very deliberately clearly made the mistake of picking the wrong target. 
even in this one, I'm sure, like, even knowing who to attack first, because I looked it up, even then, like, the fight's still pretty, you know, cut pretty close. But it, it, it was, it definitely wasn't unreasonable. Like, I didn't, like, I had to grind or look up a bunch of cards, like, make, make a completely new deck. I just had to take one or two. And I probably could have done it even without those specific cards I got, but nah, I think I'm rambling at this point. It didn't really have a lot to contribute <laughs> outside, just focused on the boss, but I didn't really want to mess that up. But regardless, I, I hope, I, it's a bit of a short one, yet I am, I think the longer these chapters get, you know, because the more enemies and the harder they get, you know, the videos are going to get longer. You know, this might be the exception, but nevertheless, I, I hope you enjoyed the boss fight. I found that it was pretty cool, despite the lack of, you know, conversation from me. I don't think that was a big loss, and hope to see you in the next one, because I, I remember the college is a really cool place uh, from a fantasy from this setting. It's a really, there's a, it's a bit of, uh, it, it'll be fun, it'll be fun. Hope to see you all then. All right, bye for now.